students of class 1 i am krishna ma'am your science teacher i hope you all are fine and safe at your home when you are at home we are here to take care of your studies through this online video classes so watch this video carefully listen it carefully okay students so let's start today's topic today we are going to discuss about chapter 3 the animal world students when you look around yourself you can see many animals around you they can be seen on land in water in air also what animals you can see in water you can see fish starfish sea horse these animals you can only see in water on land what can you see cow dog cat deer elephant these are the animals you can see in land now birds you can see them fly in air so the animals that can be seen in different places are divided into three let's look at this animals according to their places they are divided in three in one there is land animals then water animals then look what air animals land animals further divided into domestic animals land animals is there then water animals then the air animals land animals are further divided into two any kind of animals one is domestic animal second is your wild animals then water animal air animals air animals also divided in birds and insects now we will discuss one by one all type of animals first we will discuss about the land animals from this word it is very much clear that the animals which live on land are called land animals they are divided in domestic animals now what is domestic animal there are some animals 
which used to live with us, with human beings. They are called domestic animals. They are very useful to us. They give us milk, then wool, then they give us eggs. Many kind of food we can get from these animals. Some domestic animals are our pet animals also. We used to make farm from them for them to stay. We provided provide them food, shelter. Okay. Now what are these do domestic animals examples? Like cow, dog, cat, sheep. These are the domestic animals. Now what are wild animals? Wild animals are very different from domestic animals. They used to stay with us. They are far away from us. They used to live in jungle or forest. Some examples of wild animals are you know, lion, deer, bear, giraffe. These are the examples of wild animals. Domestic animals can get food from the human beings. But wild animals have to find their own food, shelter, water. They have to find by themselves. Okay? Now it is clear what is domestic animal and wild animals. Now the second one was here. What was that? Water animals. Peacock, 
crow, sparrow, penguin. Okay, these are the examples of birds. Some birds cannot fly, like penguin, emu, ostrich. These birds cannot fly. Now, insects. They are very small creatures. They have most insects have six legs. Some examples of insects are butterfly, housefly, spider. They are the insects. Now it is clear all type of animals. Do you remember animals kinds? Animals are divided in three categories. One is land animals, then water animals, then your air animals. Land animals further divided into domestic animals and wild animals. Domestic animals are examples of domestic animals, cow, goat, sheep. They are very useful to us. Wild animals are just opposite of domestic animals. They used to live in forest like lion, giraffe, deer. There are the example of wild animals. Now water animals like fish. Mostly you have seen fish. Air animals like birds, insects. Birds. They have wings to fly. And examples of birds. Crow, peacock, sparrow. Okay. The birds that cannot fly. Which are the, that birds? Ostrich and emu. Insects. Some examples of insects. Spider. Housefly. Butterfly, they are the examples of your insects. Okay, now this is clear the type of animals. Now look at this. Look at this. What is this? This is a camel, it is a domestic animal, it is known as the sheep of the desert. In the desert, their sands are there, we can't walk there comfortably. So, this camel helps us to go from one place to another place. They also carry our loads. Okay? Now, look at this. Look at this student. What is this? You are very much familiar to this feather. This is a feather of peacock. This is the example of what? What kind of animals? These are the birds. Peacock is a bird. It is the national animal, national bird of our country. Now, what is this? You can see. This is a giraffe. It is an example of yes, wild animals. It has, you can see, a long neck. It is the tallest animal. Now, I think you have understood the chapter. Now, you can do the exercise which is in page number 24, page number 24 and 25, okay. If you have any problem, you can ask me.
through telegram app you have my username okay students thank you have a nice day